my heart. I picked up some brake levers for myself. And then I went to Vale Signed. Um, I also passed in my template for the 95 that's gonna go on the back of my helmet. And now I'm going to Lonsdale Paint to pick up some paint stuff for my helmet. And then I'm going to Troy's to mask up and paint the rest of my helmet, which is super exciting. Can't wait for that. pits at Phillip Island and we are in pit shed number one so right at the front which is nice. We've got three bikes here this weekend one bike is being used as a spare bike for Petra and then I've got my other two bikes that are ready to go. We're gonna do some things to the uh, spare spare bike and then get to taking my bike scrutineering. We are going to scrutineering and then I am going to riders briefing. I have black fingerprints all over me. <laughs> it is boiling. Take your surprise in here. Oh, brand new helmet and brand new design. Pretty custom paint job by Troy at Nightmare Designs. It's probably gonna be the thumbnail of the video. Probably, I don't know. And Glenn and Cameron and everybody have already scrutinized the bikes and they're all good, obviously. big day we are only just arriving at the pub now and it's eight o'clock so we had to make sure that everything was ready got the carpets out the media boards out set the table up and the bikes up everything is completely ready to go tomorrow morning yeah very excited there's three sessions on friday and then we've got one session each on saturday and sunday so big weekend but tomorrow's the biggest day so gonna have some good dinner and an early night morning it is day one I guess officially it's Friday and we are at the beginning of the Anthony go but should be spot um at the world superbikes they always have a big expo one like showcasing um all the different brands and alpine stars and everything but this year they're doing a tribute to anthony go but where dad's got um his zx7 there and davo has got his r6 and uh, peter has also brought his two honda race bikes which is very cool oh look at this taylor ralph exhibit for the women's world championship that is very cool 
Bucky. super windy out on track and it's a sideways wind so it's pretty tricky to uh, get to grips with. The wind was pushing me to the side so when I was on the straight going into turn one it was pushing me in the complete opposite direction. I practiced some of my weak spots around the track and did really well. At the moment FP1 uh, with a 49.9 on the last lap so that was pretty good. So it's gonna be a good day, a very busy day. Felt good? Yeah. Some different uh, weather conditions out here today but yeah I'm pretty happy to put it on first but it all matters in qualifying and the racing so yeah for sure definitely thank you for that uh, yeah this year last year was just a get ready round you know just the warm-up so 2024 is gonna be my year hopefully and give it my all and the bikes are all set up now so we've got a good base and yeah really ready to get it going this year yeah I'm, I'm happy with how last year went definitely had lots of ups and downs but you know you learn from them you set up the bike differently and it just comes with knowledge and experience and yeah I'm ready to give it a shot definitely reckon there's a bit more in it I, I know there's more in it so yeah really excited for qualifying and just to get a st good solid lap and yeah I'll be happy with that always shooting for the stars always aiming for the top spot definitely um, but I'll be really happy with like a top five top ten at most rounds that'll um, tick the boxes I reckon uh, just as long as I do better than last year that's all I need from it yeah I love it yeah, it feels really smooth, really nice. The first time I came out here, I almost thought the track was wet because it was so much darker, but yeah, it feels really, really nice and smooth. I love it. Sarah, what are you doing? Ah! What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I made that. Oh, you're collecting kitty litter? Yeah. <laughs> That's how it looks like. Good, I'm all good. <laughs> How'd you go? Anything to say? I'm glad you're okay. Oh, that's nice, thank you. Fuck the mod. Hey, tell me about it. I spent probably like 48 hours sanding those herrings. <laughs> thank goodness mum's here. It's a bit loud, the um, super bikes are out, but I just went out for qualifying one. And uh, at the very end of the qualifying, I had a little low side at turn 11. I think the wind just picked me up and I was just chattering a bit and uh, low side of it, unfortunately. But um, still came out with the P2, so I'm super stoked on that. And we're going to get my helmet fixed with Marcus at the Green Dingo. Hello. <laughs> the first front row.
What do we want to happen? Come first. Want to come first. That's what I always want. No, if I call it by 16th of a second. <laughs> Two hands today. <laughs> Bloody show off yesterday, one handed. Jesus. Second off her PV. <laughs> <laughs> Fifth is great, babe. Thanks. I was second going onto the straight, but I got swamped. That's all right. I'm good through turn 12, so I think I'm going to change my strategy for tomorrow. I think I've got some new ideas. I um, finally got to actually race up at the front with the front runners today, unlike yesterday, where I was kind of just trying to get by. <laughs> But um, I really took note of where people are fast and where people are slow and uh, where people can help me and where people hinder me. So I'm going to use all of that knowledge tomorrow and hopefully get on the step. <laughs> you get on the step. <laughs> Race two is done. Um, it was first thing this morning at 8.50am, so bright and early. Uh, got off to a really good start, led the race for half a lap, which was extremely surreal. I came, I was doing good the race and then came onto the front straight in, for the last lap in second and then got swamped to the line and came fifth. Um, I'm happy with that. I was at the very, very, very front, which is a really cool feeling, doing lots of dicing, some racing, not chasing. And I got a 48-1. So that's a new PB by a whole second, which is really exciting. I'm happy, but we're going to bring out the big guns tomorrow. No excuses for tomorrow. So going to give it my best shot and uh, try to get it on the step. Good morning, day three, Sunday. The weather is a lot nicer today than it was yesterday. Blue skies for, what time is it? Seven in the morning, so that's a good sign. And, and high spirits. And high spirits, yeah.
it's going to be worth money one day. Oh. Congratulations once again. You guys want to be on YouTube? Absolutely. Thank you. Come on. 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 Come on.